How's it going everyone? Fusero Dab back again with another Elite Battle League battle. Guys, it's time. This has been an amazing season, um, and it's now time for our final main uh, main season battles and before the playoffs. That's what I'm trying to say. What, what What's before the playoffs? Just the regular games, right? <laughs> Week five, we're up against the Kentucky Kinglers, Mr. Always More Videos himself. Um, he has a very terrifying team, and uh, you know I've been prone to making mistakes, but guys, stick with me through the end. I'll give you my absolute best you already know that and i'm gonna have fun win or lose so uh gg good luck to um mr uh always more very videos excuse me derek himself uh and the kentucky kinglers uh let's get right into it uh i'm gonna go ahead and put in the code uh but before we do that um uh, pick up your Everclade Entei's merch. I'm all over the place because I'm nervous. I'm sweating. Um, don't forget to uh, subscribe, ding the notification bell at your forehead, like the video, comment. I love talking to you guys. Uh, and don't forget, uh, follow my social medias and join the Discord. Okay. I'm fully expecting him to bring um, Mimikyu and Dracovish 100%. Um, it's just the rest of his team I'm not sure about yet. I've got answers for them, I think. I'm going to play methodically and slow, but not too slow. Um, all my matches have been chess matches, except for where I've made mistakes. Um, I, I, I believe I played well. I don't think anyone can argue that I've played well. Um, it's never been a clear sweep on my end. Um, knock on wood that it doesn't happen this week. <laughs> it totally might. It totally might. All right, guys, let's go ahead and select our team today. We're taking Tyranitar, Rotom Wash, uh, uh, Bisharp, uh, Nido King, Slow King, and of course, Palkia. Uh, we've taken Palkia every week, but that's just because I, I'm not going to go into battle without my legendary. It just doesn't um, make any sense to do that. Okay, so let's see what's he's what's he's bringing. If Mimikyu is not there, I'm going to be very surprised. If Dracovish is not there, I'm going to be surprised. I'm anticipating Corviknight, maybe even Galarian Darmanitan, um, Gengar for sure. It's a powerhouse. Maybe even Lunala. Um, he might bring Snorlax, um, just because I have a lot of special attackers on my team. We'll see. Uh, Corviknight, I saw his interesting build already, so I'm not sure. I'm not sure what he's gonna end up bringing. Beef. <sighs> it's nerve wracking, guys. My heart is racing so. Hard. <laughs> I know. I've been trying my hardest, man. I've been trying my hardest. No one can. No one can tell me that I haven't been doing well. I've been doing real well. I gotta keep telling myself that so I calm down. Who's he bringing? Who's he bringing? Okay, so he brought Corviknight. He brought Corviknight. He brought Mimikyu, of course. He brought Heracross. Okay, he brought Lunala, he brought Galarian Darmanitan, and of course he brought the Snorlax. Okay, cool. So we can go, he didn't bring Dracovish. Interesting. Interesting. He didn't bring Dracovish. And he didn't bring the Gengar. Interesting. <laughs> okay, so we are indeed going to lead with Billy Mays, um, especially since Dracovish isn't on the team. Um, if he sends out Mimikyu and starts setting up, uh, we can, you know, break his disguise and switch into something else. I think it's just probably the safest bet. Without Dracovish there, the people that I'm worried about the most probably are his uh, his Galarian Darmanitan, um, his Mimikyu. He also might be running Trick Room on Lunala, so it'd be kind of interesting. I do have some bulky Mons, so I mean, I didn't really bring fast Pokemon to this, so I don't think he would bring Trick Room, but I mean, <clears throat> he might, just to trip me up. I'm trying to think of different things he could be doing. Um, I'm expecting him to either uh, start with Mimikyu or start with Lunala. If he starts with Lunala, we're going to be able to get a decent amount off. Uh, we can even Volt Switch if we want to. Um, we can Volt Switch or we can um, we can uh, protect and see what he's going to do. Um, I'm afraid of him setting up though, so I probably won't be protecting too, too much. Let's get into this, guys. Let's get into this. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry for not muting the mic. Apologize. Good luck. Good luck. Thick boy. Snorlax. Snorlax. Okay. 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 Um, so I think we should... I think we should... Um, should I go for the Will-O-Wisp? Um, we're going to eat whatever, but I think we should probably go for the Volt Switch. Uh, we can Volt Switch, and we can go into Tyranitar. <clears throat> I think regardless... Volt Switch will eat some chip damage. Let's go into Tyranitar. Let's go into Tyranitar. That or we can go into Palkia. Palkia would be good. We could bait him into Switch. Um, uh, 
Let's go into Macbeth. Uh, wait, if he does a ground type, well, he, Billy Mays, uh, I don't think he would have done, I don't, I don't think he's going to do a ground type move. If he does, then that's just, that's just bad luck because, I mean, levitate, I could have just stayed in. Yawn. Okay. Guaranteed at least one turn and then we can switch. He's not going to want to stay in for this uh, brick break for sure. We're guaranteed at least one turn to attack. Um, so... I mean, I'm kind of glad we got out there with Rotom. Rotom does not need to be asleep. Bisharp can at least get one hit off, and we can scare him into switching, potentially. If he goes out to Mimikyu, um, if he goes out to Mimikyu, um, if he goes out to Mimikyu, uh, we're, we're kind of screwed. He withdrew. Okay, we probably shouldn't have stayed in. Mimikyu? Shaved ice. Okay, well, wow, this is going to hurt. Oh, God, this is going to hurt him. Come on, take it out. Take it out. Take it out. One hit, one hit. Oh, so close, so close. Okay, and he fell asleep. Okay, that's perfectly fine. We can use him to sack off later. That's perfectly fine. Um, I'm expecting an ice type move to come out, so I think I'm going to switch into Palkia. I don't think he has, and he's gonna be locked into whatever he does, so he'll have to switch because he's not. He's not a. Uh, at least to my knowledge, um, he's not running a Zen, um, Darmanitan. So Palkia can definitely eat this. We're Water Dragon, so an ice type attack's not gonna hurt. <clears throat> we'll eat whatever he's wanting to do, and we'll get some pressure off on him. Earthquake. Okay. I could have gone into, okay, with that being, oh god, that did so much damage. Oh my god. Oh my god, that did so much damage. Oh, Jesus. Um, wow, that was huge. I think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna try to, I'm gonna try to, I'm gonna switch again. I'm gonna try to get him to do another Earthquake. we we'll try to see if he can do another Earthquake. I'm gonna switch into Billy Mace. I should have gone into Billy Mace in the first place. Okay, not bad. He's getting chip damage, which is good damage. Earthquake, okay, cool. Good predict, good predict. See, I'm playing okay, you know? I'm playing okay. Um, so I think he's just gonna let it go down, so I'm gonna go ahead, Thunderbolt. <clears throat> smart, smart move just to let it go down. Um, I don't, do we outspeed Galarum and Darmanit? I don't know if we do or not, do we? Rotom's fast, but he's not that fast. Not sure. He's thinking about it, he's thinking about it. Does he wanna sack him off or does he want and get the clean switch? Or does he wanna try to save him for something else? Galarian Darmanitan is one of the ones I was worrying about. I should have gone into Rotom because I, I forgot he ran Earthquake. Um, let's get him out of here. Let's get him out of here. I'm glad we switched into Rotom because he was just going to do another Earthquake and take out Palkia. So we saved Palkia at least one more turn. What you doing? What you doing, Eric? Withdrew. Okay, so chip damage is good damage. Thick Boy is coming back out. Um, That's fine. That's fine. Oh, that did a good bit. It was a crit, okay. Um, um, I'm afraid of whatever this thing can do. Um, so I think I'm gonna go out to Drax and get the Sandstorm up, and I'm gonna uh, he's gonna he's gonna he's gonna do some chip damage, um, on on Drax, which is fine. But um, I want to make sure that we can get some physical attacks on this on this thing because it's not gonna go down otherwise, and I don't want to give him the chance to set up. Sandstorm will also. Um, give him give him a chip damage and it won't do anything to me amnesia so he is setting up so he got that free switch which is unfortunate um but i mean we are a physical attacker so it should be fine we just need to go with stab crunch i think stab crunch is probably the best thing to do um base 80 yeah yeah so we're going with stab crunch stab crunch for sure <coughs> excuse me stab crunch amnesia ain't gonna help you here buddy oh wow okay he still lived and we got the defense drop yes let's go Seed bomb. Oh god. Oh god. That's gonna hurt. But we lived it. Okay, wow. Uh that didn't do as much as I thought. Buffeted by the sandstorm, that's perfectly fine. we got a we got a couple of his Pokemon down to red, which is good. Is he gonna stay in or is he gonna um and sack off Snorlax or is he gonna try to go into something else and save it? This is this is a really good it's kind of a chess match already. Okay, so we take down the Snorlax, Snorlax goes down. <coughs> Excuse me. Good. Good, good, good. That's at least one kill for us. This is a great match so far. We're both playing really exceptionally well. I feel like everyone's played exceptionally well in this. Um, just watching everyone's stuff. There's there's definite mistakes on everyone's part, but I mean, nothing we can nothing we can do. Nothing we can do. Okay, he's gonna earthquake. I'm gonna predict the earthquake. I'm going straight to Macbeth. Or not Macbeth. Uh, Billy Mays. I'm not going to Macbeth. I wish he hadn't have fallen asleep, but we are guaranteed at least one turn to attack. Please EQ. Please EQ. Oh my god, what if I read this? If I read this, this is huge. 
Dang it, U-turn. Okay, that's fine. Chip damage. Chip damage. Oh, that did a bit. That did a bit. That did a bit. Okay. That would have hurt Tyranitar. For sure. So, Billy Maze, I'm glad that you're able to do it. Casper. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so Mimikyu's coming out. Perfectly fine. Uh, I want to break the disguise. Number one, I want to break the disguise. Um, so, I'm hoping we can at least get the disguise break. Um... We don't want him swords dance. He's getting a free swords dance, which is fine. Um, definitely not good. And oh god, Macbeth is asleep. Oh jeez. Tyranitar is our only thing to break this thing now because it has Iron Head. We have Iron Head on him today. I'm glad I didn't let Tyranitar go down because Bisharp is. Um, that's fine. <laughs> okay, so I think I'm gonna do the smart play and I'm gonna go out to Bisharp and then let him take out Bisharp. And uh, we get a clean, clean switch. We'll get a clean switch. Clean switch into Titar. We broke the disguise. He's gonna get a free. He's gonna get a free knockout, which is fine. But uh, Bisharp's kind of useless right now because he's asleep. If he's he's Dynamaxing. Okay, we waste one turn of Dynamax. That's good. Uh, please use the Ghost type move. Oh my God! Please have used a Ghost type move. Oh my God! If we predicted it and if he used a, if he used Max Phantasm. Oh my God! If it's play rough, it you know. Does play rough? Does play rough affect uh, steel type? I don't think so. Max, max overgrow. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Uh, there's no way we're living this. Oh, we lived it. Interesting. Okay, we can eat up two of his turns. Wow, that was amazing. That was that was perfect. That was absolutely perfect. Absolutely perfect. Okay, absolutely perfect. And we can live another one. Can we live another one? Oh my god. Uh, let's see if we can. Let's see if we can wake up. Let's see if we can wake up. Please wake up. Max Starfall. Okay. This is gonna hurt. It's gonna hurt. Okay. Yeah. That's fine. We waste two of his Dynamax turns. We go out to Rotom Wash and we protect. And he'll live. Uh, he won't take full damage from it. Um, and we waste his Dynamax. That's great. So we're down two. That's fine. That's fine. No, we're, we're only down one. What am I saying? We're down one. Uh, we're playing pretty pretty well right now, I would say. I'd say we go. Uh, I, I say we go into. He's a he's a physical attacker. Um, so I'm gonna I'm gonna protect. I think I'm gonna protect. First first turn protect. Um, waste his waste his last Dynamax move. I think this is the smartest play. And he's plussed up with Sword Stance, so I think after this, um, he's got Hair Cross Lunala. Um, Darmanitan, who's on his last leg, and Corviknight. Um, I think we we get some chip damage, and we sack off Billy Maze, and we go straight into the Titar after this. <clears throat> that or we go into, pa uh, not Palkia, excuse me. Okay, we live. Nice. Nice. Okay. We lived. We lived. We lived. We lived. Okay, we wasted his Dynamax. We wasted his Dynamax. Which is great. We could also go out to Eddard. We could we can clean switch into Eddard by sacking off Rotom Wash. Clean switch into Eddard. We could also freaking Dynamax from there. We could. We could. Um. Let's try to get some chip damage. Let's try to get some chip damage. Shadow Sneak. He's gonna go first. He's gonna get the. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Okay. So the question is. Shadow Sneak's gonna hurt. Sloking. Um, he's got Darmanitan and left. He's got Corviknight. He's got Heracross. So we're down two. He's down one. So we got to Eddard and Dynamax. I mean... Oh, gosh. We don't have anything. Uh, I mean, Drax is... I don't think Drax is going to live, though. That's the problem. We can try. I mean, he has Fire Punch for Corviknight. Um, and Heracross, which is good. Um, I don't think he's gonna, even with Swords Dance, I don't think he's gonna, gosh. Um, I say we got to Drax. I'm just gonna go for it. I'm just gonna go for it. I'm just gonna go for it. I, I don't think Mimikyu outspeeds Tyranitar. I might be wrong. I, I, I'm not 100%, not but at least we get the chip damage with the Sandstorm, which is fine. Um... Let's go with the Iron Head. That's fine. I want to get this thing down a little bit. 
I mean, we're playing well. I feel like I feel like regardless win or lose at this point, we've played well. We've avoided getting swept. Um at least initially. We're not getting boom 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 boom. You know what I mean? So I mean, if we outspeed this Mimikyu, then this this is just Okay, no. Oh, it's gonna oh god, wood hammer. Oh god, we're dead. We're so dead. We're so dead. <clears throat> we're so dead. Okay, so there's Tyranitar. Tyranitar goes down. Okay. Hit with the recoil, buffeted by Sandstorm, that's fine. Gosh, that's so unfortunate. I was hoping that Tyranitar would at least, you know, live that or whatever. Okay, we don't have a lot of options left. Um, oh, gosh. Summary. What's our defenses like? Defense is not good. Um, I say we go Eddard and we Dynamax. There's no other way. There's no other way. I mean, we can live. I feel like we can live a single one, but that Mimikyu is just so tough. If we Dynamax, we go... Uh, I mean, Max Quake would be great. Max, yeah, Max Quake is the best attacking move. I mean, nothing super effective on this thing that we have. Should have brought. I should have brought like an uh, a steel type move on this thing. But at least we can live one with Dynamax. Uh, I don't think he uh, even with Swords Dance. I don't think he'll one shot a Dynamaxed. Um, oh, he withdrew. Interesting. He withdrew. Okay, Zazu. Oh, oh, Jesus Christ. Oh no. Oh, that's awful. Oh, that's awful. That's wasted. Oh God, one turn wasted. One turn wasted. One turn wasted. You hate to see it. One, one turn wasted. Oh, okay. I did not expect him. I, he was set up. I didn't expect him to. I didn't expect him to pull out. There's no way. There, are there. There's no feasible reason. I um, mean, that was such a good prep. Pre, uh, if he predicted that Max Quake, then dude, more on you, dude. I mean, regardless, I don't think anyone else can resist this thing. Max Lightning, this thing's down. Corviknight's down. It ain't living no Max Lightning. Oh, it lived the Max Lightning? You serious? Are you serious? Wow. I cannot believe any roosted. <sighs> wow. Lost flying dot. Wow. Wow. Dude, freaking GG on that, man. That was amazing. What a good predict if you predicted that. Guys, I don't know if I don't know if we have this one just because of this. Oh, we got it. Okay, 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 okay. So that was uh, that's our last Dynamax, though. Okay, we got down the Corviknight. Corviknight goes down. Okay. Okay, okay. Um, Darmanitan's probably coming out next. I don't think he's going to send out Mimikyu. Shaved Ice. Okay, Mimik uh, Darmanitan's coming out. Now he can't... I completely forgot. Completely forgot that he had Corviknight. I did not expect him to switch from Mimikyu to Corviknight. That was so interesting. Did not expect that at all. Okay, so what's doing the most here? Earth Power. Sludge Wave. No matter what he goes into, Sludge Wave is hurting. <coughs> Sludge Wave is stab, or sheer force, and I don't think this thing outspeeds. I don't think this thing outspeeds. I, I, I'm. He does. Wow. He does outspeed. Wow. I thought Edard was. I thought Edard would out outspeed. Wow. Okay, that was a misplay. I think this game has been decided, y'all. I think it really has, and honestly, honest to God, has. It's been decided. Dang. I would have loved to have won my last battle, but I mean, one and four. Dang it. I mean, at least we're a regenerator with this, but it doesn't matter. Earthquake. Eh, we're, we're not living this. There's no way. Or no, there's no way. There's no way. There's no way. I mean, I feel like I played exceptionally well. I feel like it, it, the, the Mimikyu, that Mimikyu swap, that was definitely what changed the tide of this game. Because had I been able to take out the Mimikyu and keep going from there, the the, the, the pace would have been great. I mean, there's nothing I think I could have done differently. Um, I feel like I feel like my strategy was kind of on point. I mean, I, I, I really don't think there was any misplays other than other than expecting like a, a speed difference, a speed differential. Okay, we take out his Darmanitan for whatever whatever it's worth. At least we get the kill death, you know. So we took out three of his mons, and he's got three left. Um, we might be. I mean, depending on who he takes out next, we might be able to take him out. It just depends. Palkia is fast. It just depends. If he sends out Heracross, we're. I think we should be able to outspeed it. 
Like, I, I keep saying that, but we he keeps outspeeding us. Death Star. Who's this? Oh, okay. Interesting. What a good name. Um, ah, There's nothing. It doesn't matter what we do to this thing. Might as well go for the stab, I guess. I don't know. Spatial end. Oh, we outsped it. Okay. See what we get. See what we can do. Yeah, doesn't matter. <laughs> doesn't matter. It was a crit. Doesn't matter. This game's over. Good game. Moongeist beam. Good game. Wow. I mean, I tried. I really did. I don't think anyone can argue that I did my best. I don't... I, I didn't play bad either. You know, the. Uh, I feel like... I honest to God felt like this was a really good game. I mean, I took out three of his months. So, I mean, the kill-death ratio is not terrible. Um, What a good game. I mean, like I said, I expected Dracovish to come in and just completely bop me. So, that's what I was kind of, like, anticipating. But, I mean, we live and we learn. Like I said, you know, I would love to take your league card, by the way. It was a great league card. Okay. So, a couple things, a couple things about this. We're one and four, and that's fine. We're one and four. Um, looks like, uh, depending on how this week goes, it will probably be facing up against uh, the Detroit Luxury again, and I'm planning on making a comeback. We can still get a title if we win and we do exceptionally well in the playoffs. Um, you know, I, I'm proud of how I played. I felt like that was absolutely awesome. I feel like me using my turns to influence the dynamax for his side um was good i feel like um you know his switch from mimic you was a deciding factor his switch from mimic you completely did not under i should have gone for i should have gone for sludge wave i should have gone for sludge wave i just went with power i didn't think about corviknight coming out he was set up he was good to go i don't know i don't know but like i said oh hey hello <laughs> like i said guys I think I did an I think I did an exceptional job. I don't think anyone can argue with me there. Um, uh, you know, keep supporting your Everglade Entes. Like I said, we're gonna keep learning. We're gonna keep doing better. Don't give us don't give up on us. We're we're gonna keep getting better. Season two, especially after we're done with the playoffs, season two is going to be amazing. We're gonna keep living and learning from these experiences. Don't forget to rep your merchandise, guys. It is an absolute awesome time and it helps support the channel and you look awesome while doing it um make sure you subscribe for more ding that notification bell on your forehead like the video comment i love talking to you guys and i love interacting with you guys um join the discord i'd love to talk to you guys even more uh, you know through the discord and whatnot uh, follow my social medias i give clips and stuff like that on tiktok and twitter and instagram pretty regularly so and it's the quickest way to learn if i'm going streaming or something like that <laughs> once again absolutely fantastic job um to derek uh, uh always more videos the kentucky kinglers however many names he's got <laughs> absolutely fantastic job i felt like that was an amazing chess match um you know i'm proud of how i played i'm proud of how he played that was a really 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 fun match um so guys i think that's about it for me so have yourself an incredible rest of your day but above all else stay excellent to each other and i'll see you next time mm -hmm.